It was only five years ago when Rita Brent performed her first comedy act. She took the stage surrounded by family and friends, and while she didn't think it was a great performance, something special happened that night. For most of my life, I've been a musician and uh, an, an academic, and then out of the blue, I was at an open mic at this place called Sweet 106. People from Jackson might be familiar with it. I was at the open mic, and there were some guys there doing comedy, and I started getting chills, and the hair on my arms started rising. I said, what's happening? And I swear, God spoke to me. He sounded like Barry White, and he was like, you can do this. I was like, whoa, God, whoa. So uh, two weeks later, I was on stage doing stand-up comedy. I did a five-minute set that night, and I think I got paid $25, and I was like, well, this is just another stream of income to help me pay off my student loans. So I just decided to take it seriously five years ago. One of Rita's biggest supporters has been her mother, Angela, who says she wasn't surprised by Rita's decision to become a comedian. Well, I was surprised and then I wasn't surprised because she's always been funny. And then I'm funny. People don't know that I'm funny, but I'm funny. So she came up around a lot of comedy. Her grandmother is funny. She, she has a very special relationship with her grandmother. And a lot of the things that her grandmother says it's, it's all funny, you know, so I was surprised and then I wasn't surprised because again, I was leaning on the drums or the music part of it. Since then, Rita has made great strides in the entertainment industry. She has shared the stage with some of the biggest names in stand-up comedy, including Ricky Smiley, Kevin Hart, and the late Dick Gregory. In 2016, she met comedian and radio personality Ricky Smiley, and he took her under his wings as a mentee. She often tours with him on the Ricky Smiley and Friends tour. So what was it about what was it about her that made me want to give her a chance? She's humble, she's funny, she's professional, she's a Sara, uh, and, and, and she's lovable and cute, and I just absolutely love her. As a matter of fact, we spend time together, we go out on the boat, we really kick it. So I love her, and she's one of my favorite Sara ever. And uh, I just absolutely love her, uh, you know, so I add her to my little sister list. So that's what it is about her, because she's really sweet and she a drummer, because I'm taking drum lessons now, so I'm trying to be just as good at drum as her, so maybe she could teach me some lessons or whatever, but I'm really proud of her and I'm uh, glad to be working with her. Summer 2017, Rita decided to bet on herself and become a full-time comedian. Soon thereafter met comedy mogul Kevin Hart. She was featured on Heart of the City, Film True TV's Laugh Mob, Laugh Tracks, awarded first runner-up in the American Black Film Festival's Comedy Wings competition, performed at the Essence Festival 2018 as a main stage act, and the Just For Last Festival in Montreal, Canada. If I wanted to just look at her right now, I would just tell her how much I love her and how grateful I am for her journey. I would tell her to always remember her journey and share her journey as she goes higher because just like somebody's journey helped her, her journey is gonna help somebody. Comedian Rita Brent, the 2019 Young, Gifted, and Empowered Artist of the Year.